Hey guys, it's Hamo here. Today we're going to look at how to bulk upload images to the WordPress Media Library. Now sure you can just drag and drop files in WordPress, but if you've got hundreds of files to do, this could take some time. So there is a quicker way. First, you'll want to compress the files into a zip format. We do that by just simply right clicking the files once you've selected them and click add to zip. Now we should have a zip file that's available for upload. Now there's a couple of ways you can upload a file to your WordPress server. You can use an FTP client like FileZilla, which is a little bit complicated to set up sometimes. Or if you're using WordPress on Bluehost, you can use their cPanel interface. Just go to your cPanel and click on File Manager. Then in the File Manager, you want to navigate to the wp-content directory. And from here, we'll just go into Uploads. This is where all the files are uploaded to when you upload them through the WordPress interface. Now you can install the files into the various years. We might go into 2016 and we might just create a new folder. I'm just going to call it quotes and create folder. And we're just going to keep things separate here. So we go into the quotes directory and it, as you can see it's empty. Now we want to go up to upload. We choose the file and we select the zip file that we zipped up earlier. As you can see, the system has started to do the upload. Because we've zipped it, it's going to be a lot quicker than setting the files individually. And if you've got hundreds of files to upload, well, this is a much quicker way. So let's go back to the file manager again. We just hit reload here and we should see our new folder. We click on the zip file and hit extract. We can just extract these files and that's done really quickly. Again, we reload to refresh the screen. So now we've got the files up to the WordPress server. Let's go back to WordPress. Now, the files don't appear in WordPress automatically because you need to tell WordPress where they are. We do that with a plugin called Add From Server. If you just go to Plugins and Add New and just search for Add From Server, you need to install and activate this plugin. I've already done this, but it's quick and easy to do. So let's go over to media and then add from server. And now you just want to click on the uploads folder and we're going to go to 2016. And here's our folder called quotes. Now we just need to select the files we want to import. You can select all of them and just untick the ones you don't need. And then we just click import. Okay, these have been added to the media library. So if we quickly go over and have a look, we can see the new files have been added automatically for us and are now available to add into our WordPress post. That's all I've got time for today. Please subscribe to the channel, tell your friends and bye for now.